Hey everybody, I hope y'all are all having a magnificent day. You may notice a few changes to my channel. Um, I'm changing the channel name and the description and a few other things. Um, as I'm figuring out exactly what I want to do with this channel. But today's video is going to be painting my kitchen. I started this project last October. I painted the bottom. I still needed to paint the, the two drawers, but I painted all of the bottom. I like the paint. It stayed really good. It cleans well. Today we are going to finish. I'm going to take all the doors off, um, clean everything up. I've already taken the doors off of um, over my fridge. I'm going to clean everything out, um, wipe everything down really, really good. And we're going to paint. We're going to get it done. It's going to look super nice. All right, y'all, at this point, I have taken all the doors off of my upper cabinets. Sorry about the light from the window. But I've taken all the doors off of the upper cabinets. And now I'm gonna take everything out of the upper cabinets give them a good sanding and wipe them out let them dry and then we are going to start painting we're about halfway through
Okay, y'all. Now I have just sanded the surfaces that I'm going to paint. And the next thing I'm going to do, I'm not going to do it on camera. I'm just going to wipe everything down with a wet cloth. Just to get the sanding dust. And then we're going to start painting uh, this first half of my kitchen. See you in a bit. All right. I just want to show y'all real fast, if you think you can't do a project like this, these little sanders, this one I got for, from Walmart, it's just a hyper tough, it's a cheap one, but I got this from Walmart for about $15. The sandpaper squares, I got a whole big pack of them, I mean like a big pack like this at the Dollar Tree for one dollar. Now these sanders are so super simple. You basically plug them in, you go, they have like a little dust catching bag, that's what those holes are for. You're going to put your sandpaper on top of there, kind of make sure it's even in the middle, and you're just going to wrap it like this. To be able to see. I'm just gonna be able just gonna wrap it and you see there's this little hinge that's what that little thing does. You want to clamp it down. That's the front. Make sure it goes under the clamp in the back and you just want to clamp the back. Now these come with a cute little tool that looks like this this you put it over your sander and apply pressure just like that this is what puts the holes in the sandpaper now I'm gonna go finish sanding the rest of my kitchen and wipe it down and I'm gonna get to painting
at you guys for right now. That's going to be it. I will paint the doors off camera. I will put a few more coats off camera and I will show you guys the end result when I am finished in a few days. I'll see you guys then.